you are asking yourself how do we happen to have these menu items over here now these are actually pages and to have a page over there you simply come over here to the pages section or you can even select a post or you can select custom links or even categories in this case we added pages so these are the available pages in our website but we may add one page and that page uh, is supposed to be available in your wordpress website so how do you add a page you simply come over here to pages and then you say add a new page and under here you can simply add a page title or a page name and we are going to add a page called services once you are done you simply hit publish and publish now that means that your page will be now available a page called services when we come under to our all pages realize that now we have a new page called services just created seven seconds ago when we come here to our menu you don't see any page called services now how do we add a page called services over here simply come back to our dashboard and we are going to come over here to appearance menus and right there we are in position to look up here in the page section and look up for a page called services now it is over here and we can simply select that page and then add to menu when you add to menu you simply have the menu item added over here you can reposition it anywhere in your wordpress website let me just bring it over here after the about services and before the portfolio now what i'm going to do is simply to save menu when i save menu and i come over here to our main website and i reload the website boom you realize that now we have a new menu item called services when we open that page it doesn't have anything because we haven't yet added anything to that page simply the header and the footer are showing up because by default every page is having or every page is assigned a header and the footer okay when we come back to our dashboard maybe you're asking how do we happen to have a menu now a menu can be created and also assigned to a specific section of your website let me show you first thing we can come over here and say create a new menu and you can give that menu a name let me say this is going to be our footer menu and then we create the menu we can assign sections or items to that menu for example you can assign pages like i said posts custom links or even categories let me assign just pages over here for example i may assign a page called services testimonials and the privacy policy but before i'm going to first save my menu and then i'm going to come back here to pages i'm going to make sure that we have our page called privacy policies published at the moment it is a draft page so we can't have it shown up on our website so when we preview this page this is how it looks like it has privacy contact information that by default wordpress adds to your wordpress website when i go back over here i'm going to edit this page and by editing you can make changes to the contact information or the information in this page for example you can highlight you can delete a section you can delete or you can reformat a heading something like that and all that stuff at the moment i simply want to publish this page so that i make it available to be shown on our website now the page is published when i come back here to pages you realize that the page has been changed from draft to now published okay now what we are going to do is simply come back to our appearance menus and we are going to come here to our footer menu of course you can select which menu you want to edit from the drop down over here at the moment we have our footer menu selected now I'm going to come over here to view all and I'll look up for our privacy page which is over here then I can add this privacy page to our menu the same I can do for services and testimonials I can just simply add them over there I can reorganize these pages to how I want them to appear in our footer section I can simply now save changes when I save changes now that means that we have updated our footer menu but how do we assign our footer menu to basically be in the footer you simply come over here to the menu settings display location and say footer menu now this footer menu of ours will be set to be actually the footer menu on our website now we're going to go back here and simply save 
changes.